What is up guys? Today we are back with another episode in the Funny Launch series. Today we will be covering the Sloop Launch. So, how does it work? Well first, you need to get yourself inside of the higher railing here. The one that's more in on the boat. This one that I'm aiming at. And you will do that by using the same method used on the brig launch, which is the ladder cancel. Unlike the brig launch, this one is a little bit faster. You need to ladder cancel faster and you need to do it a little bit more precisely. With brig launch, there's a little bit of room to mess up and you'll still get a good brig launch. But on this one, you need to be like almost perfect. Another thing is that sloop launch will send you diagonally to the right out of the boat and not perpendicular like brig launch does. You will get much more speed from a sloop launch, but the trade-off is difficulty. It's much harder to pull off. At about this top step before you're on the top deck, this one right here, and you can kind of make sure you're lined up by looking to the right and like lining yourself up with this post. And then you want to jam yourself against the railing as much as you can, and then F to ladder cancel and do it very quickly. Now I'm in ladder, or not ladder, in railing, and you will hit A and spacebar. Bam. Oh my gosh, what a brig launch. Not a brig launch, a sloop launch. You can do a lot of dolphin diving. <laughs> I am gone. I'm still going. I don't even know how many mermaids I've gotten yet. You can see that sent us like ridiculously far. These waves are too big to really see where the boat is now. Oh yeah, see? That's where we were. This is just showing you how crazy the sloop launch is. We can kind of use Sailor's Not Stronghold to kind of gauge where we were. So, we're here at the Stronghold. Our boat was about here in our view. And considering you go to the diagonal right, we can say we probably got around here. A whole square is how far you can launch with the sloop launch. It is absolutely insane. So yeah, that is the end of this tutorial. As always, if you guys have any questions or any suggestions, leave them in comments. And yeah, have a good one. Whatever I see